with all the popper downships coming from Commander Masters, I've got to do some preparing. I got to play some decks that are going to take advantage of some new cards. And I got really excited because I thought, you know what? Let's try something new. Try a deck that I haven't played before. And in preparation for a card like Cryptic Serpent, I really wanted to try out Blue Black Terror. Telerian Terror just is such a cool card to get down. So much protection, so hard for your opponents to deal with. And in this game, you're going to see how I draw absolutely insane against burn and i did get really lucky i will acknowledge that but i'll take that with my very first game of blue black control enjoy trying my hand at demir control and i think i think this hand's actually good i think this is fine the one land with the double lorian and a ponder i think is ooh, okay well it just got a lot worse <laughs> the hand just got a lot worse suffocating fumes though if i can get to that this this will be fine uh okay so we gotta start dumping cards into our yard um snuff out is a joke i think i want this any order so we're gonna go yeah what i want to draw next turn so snuff out ponder archaeologist no pass through and then i'm happy to mill those cards i'm happy to mill the snuff out don't have a force just yet. They're, they're starting off slow. The double implement is actually great here. So play the Falaji. I think I'm supposed to actually not get anything here in this matchup. Spell Pierce. Yo, cast down or spell Pierce. I think cast down. Yeah, we're going to get cast down. Yeah, I have an 03 blocker. I'm going to get cast down. I can Lorien revealed into a tapped swamp and then i can ponder into something hopefully this isn't this isn't bad this is actually like a really like i'm surprised we're being given this much room so i'm not gonna what i'm counting what i got here because they're they're forcing their implements here they're not drawing anything which is great yeah voldarian epicure fantastic i'm at 17 i'm on turn three which is great um we're gonna lorian uh actually it's probably better to ponder right yeah we ponder first okay so i'm gonna go mm. i don't really need deep analysis that's the thing yeah i don't really need deep analysis yeah no draw it play it and then put lorian into my yard i untap cast down i can play Tolarian terror or i can lorian again and i can double terror i'm gonna lorian regardless i might actually have to cast suffocating fumes so depending on how their turn goes that's two artifacts depending on how their turn goes i might actually have to cast double i'll happily block here yeah that's fine um we're gonna lorian might actually be better i mean one two three four five five uh it might actually be better for me to get the island because then i can actually triple yeah actually just getting the untapped island might be better here because then i can triple do this um lorian cycle lorian i have a lot i have so many threats here Cycling Lorien is probably a bit more optimal. Thinking about like the main board raise, which is like painful. Let's play Telerian Terror. I think I just play it out. You know what? Just no counter spells, just play it out. I'm at 17. Just play this out. Play Gurmag Angler. Yeah, just just show them show them the might of of blue white con of blue black control. Show them the might. Fifteen power. 
15 power. Just play it all out. And just go opponent, you know? It could very well just have it. Okay. I mean, one of the spells is Lava Dart. Okay. I mean, that was only, yeah, that was only two. Yeah, that, that Gal Blast was only hitting for two. It's good. You got opponent. I like that. Using up a mana to cycle that away, that's good. That's good. Hopefully, I think we have a main board unexpected fangs. I think we do. Let's see here. I think we have a main board unexpected fangs here. Yeah, we have two. Okay. Yeah, because that's going to be pretty crucial here. play ice tunnel i have to cast down one of these i can't i can't suffocating fumes i think i or i just attack because i don't think i can afford i think i just attack yeah i don't think i can afford like i think i have to like cast down yeah they'll double or so yeah they'll double block that's fine because I don't like if they play like Monastery Swift Spear and start doing some garbage, like I think I have to hold up a counter spell here. At 15. They, I have lethal next turn. Unless I have to cast Suffocating Fumes, then, then it gets kind of awkward. But we'll see. So 15 power. Who knew? Control. Doing crazy stuff. I mean, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna counter that, and then I'm gonna cast down your thing. Do you have it? GG's opponent. I got 15 on board. Let's go. I didn't even need to cast the mental note. I don't know if I, I don't know if my games of control will ever be that good. So the. <laughs> Oh, baby. Yep. All of that. Uh, all of this, too. Uh, <laughs> um, truly, truly. Okay. So, Agony Warp, Snuff Outs, all out, 100%. That is not a cute card to be playing in this matchup. Um, deep Analysis is interesting. I think Sp uh, spell, Pier spell Pierce is fine. Thought Scour, Cast Down, Counter Spell. Like, I could drop one Counter Spell. I think deep analysis is kind of awkward. Need two cards, eh? I think we can drop cast down, right? Like we're being a bit more efficient with our the thing. I think one suffocating fumes is actually not bad. It's not bad because they are going to go wide. I think one suffocating fumes is good. Um, I'm actually going to then drop a deep analysis. Crawl from the cellar. Yeah, I don't I don't think they're really gonna be in the mode of removing my creatures. Yeah, it doesn't really provide any bonus other than that. But yeah, I, I'm pretty sure it's the three unexpected fangs. Hydroblast dispel blue, like <laughs> it's like the whole package. Um yeah. The only thing that cast on would help with is like the white 2-2 samurais. Um think I have to keep this can I do better this is this is like literally my first league with this deck so I, I don't know how greedy I should get but like two blue elemental blasts uh, I don't I don't know it feels as good as it's gonna get they mull once which is great that's one less card I gotta fend with relic sucks doesn't really help them against angler but relic sucks that's fine. Or not Angler, like Talarian Terror. Like they have to like preemptively, you know. <laughs> Double Relic. All right. What do you got for me? Okay, I'll play the Falaji. Nice. The lands are actually like really nice here. 
Play the Philology Archaeologist. Oh, we have counter magic. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 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 That's fine. That's fine. So we're going to play a slow game against control today. Okay. That's fine with me. <laughs> that's, it's, it's fine with me. It's fine. Because if you're going to play a slow game, I can hard cast. You, you know, I can get to seven mana. I don't, I don't mind. I can get there. I'll blue this. Sure. Activate all you want. I, I will not have a graveyard this game by the looks of it, so. Yeah, Lorien will be necessary. Um, I should Lorien now. I should Lorian now. That's fine. Oh. The double relic is so annoying, but we'll play this game. Um, get the Aquifier. They could be playing Rays. Rays is a problem, but like I have two Hydra. I have two counter spells for their for their red stuff, so. Sure. Okay. <laughs> like we're gonna play this game. Okay. All right, opponent. Um, next turn, I think I might take a turn off and just deep analysis. I think. Or do I just save it? Because deep analysis is probably good. I kind of like. I, I'm kind of worried about the the pyroblast. Like actually, kind of worried about the pyroblast. Oh, oh, we're playing this game. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Thought Scour. So if I Thought Scour myself, it's like three. It's like three. It's like a ramp, right? For three. Then what I do is I have three left. It's not it's not exactly enough it's not exactly i need one more land yeah yeah, yeah. don't thought scour now because let's say for example i don't draw land it's it's too greedy it's too greedy i want to confirm 100 percent that i can play the angler 100 percent that i can play the angler no that's fine I want to confirm 100% that I can play the angler. Land. Okay, that's fine. Like, I don't need to make an action if they're not going to make an action right now. I, I don't I don't need to. They may eventually get there. Okay, just let's see if they commit spells into this. Activate relic. Just I not having a graveyard is very annoying. It's very annoying here. Land. Next turn. Okay. Next turn I will do this then. Next turn I will thought scour. That was a mistake. I should have hydro blasted that. That's fine. I should have hydro blasted that. That's not good. Yeah, I should have hydro blasted that. I like pass through. I'm like, oh, it's not a threat. No, I should. I should have hydro blasted that. Uh, okay. Thought scour. No, 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 no! I milled them. I milled them. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? No. 
<laughs> my bad habits of playing mill my bad habits of playing mill they're coming through right now folks they are coming through my bad mill habits it's like yo thought scour mill them oh i made a mistake all right yeah xl that that's fine okay so draw two cards oh okay i guess i'll have to hard cast this angler because i literally don't know how to play this game yep that's gone So they'll probably create a 2-2, two -two, which is kind of annoying. No, eh? Alright. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I just hard cast angler and then I just start attacking. Yeah, I just I just hard cast angler. We're at that point. We're at that point. And I will keep my suffocating fumes up unless like I can go for the win or I'm desperate. But I think if they like cold Dotha rebirth and like they start doing some crazy stuff that way, then it gets a little scary. Are they going to just throw like a bunch of like burn spells at this? That'd be great. Yeah. See, th this is where I keep the suffocating fumes. This is where I keep the suffocating fumes. That's fine. Swift Spear. Mm, deep analysis is nice because then I can cast that twice. Suffocating fumes. Cast that. Cast that for sure. Go to combat. Attack. Oh, it's actually creatures your opponent controls too. That's actually great it's not even me better than i thought reading the card explains the card I think we're actually we're actually in a pretty good spot like I, I i counter counter a lot here i counter this and then i counter the i counter the experimental synthesizer and then i can like deep analysis and uh thing that's okay yeah, 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 yeah. All right. No. Go away. You're not doing that. You're not going deeper into your deck. Have all the interaction in the world, sure. All right. What do you what do you got from your opponent? Yeah, bolt this. Okay. All right. Double bolt. That's fine. Okay, well I have to deepen. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna recast it. One. <laughs> Yo, opponent is mad. Opponent is mad. They are ir they are so irritated. They are so irritated. Alright. Flame breather is fine. Flame breather is fine. Flame breather is hilarious. Alright. That's even better. I'll go to combat. Attack. All right, go to damage. You're at 10. Talarian Terror. Got Pyroblast? All right, bet. You're top decking then. You're top decking. I like that game. At 19, I like that game. Because I'm going to... I can deep analysis. I bolt myself on the deep analysis, which is fine. But that's one relic gone, which is great. That's that's one less thing for me to worry about. Synthesizer is scary. I did spend a whole game, like, doing some non... Oh, yes. Just finding land off the top. Beautiful. Yup. Love it. Relics are gone. Relics are gone. Unless they drew another one. Very well could have drawn another one. Do they spend? Yes. Spend it. Spend it. Spend the other. Spend it. Yes. 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 Oh, these trades are amazing. These trades are amazing. I actually drew insane. Insane against this deck. The trade is amazing. Deep analysis. Draw two cards. 
I still have like all of my threats. Insane. Cause Tolarian. Hmm. This is five mana. I have five exactly. No, I don't. I miscounted. Um, I think I cast Lorien Revealed. I think I just cast Lorien Revealed. Insane. Insane. It's about to go. It's about to go hard. It's about to go hard. Okay. Yep. Yeah, synthesizer. You create a 2-2. Two, two. Ooh, Gal Blast. Okay. That's fine. That's just two. That's not a problem. They will cast it this turn though. Yep. Take three. That's fine. Okay, yeah, so let that combat, let that combat go through. I'm at 11. Now it's getting kind of dicey. I will say now it's getting kind of dicey, but the Telerian Terror draws are, are good here. It is good. So I can play one, five. Oh, I can play two. Yeah, that is a second spell in there. Play two. That way now combat damage, I don't have to worry about. Still gonna have to deal with stuff from spells though. Flame breather, okay. Not cute. Play the other one. Go to combat, attack. There's no point in me playing the other. Uh, no point in me playing the other. Yeah, so they have to block one. They go to five. Playing the other land. I might as well make them think that I, I have something. Casting off, and they just give it to me. Okay, perfect. All right, so we did have some misplays in there. There, there were some like a misplay or two in there, but we managed to draw ourselves out. And and you know what? Thankfully, we never ended up needing to actually having to like mental note myself and like all that stuff. So, all right, so far, okay, I would say a rocky start, but we we drew insane. Like we drew insane. Um, so I'll take it.